الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الخلق والمرسلين سيدنا وحبيبنا وقائدنا محمد صلى الله عليه وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم تسليما كثيرا يا رب العالمين My brothers and sisters السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Many of us, if not all of us, are aware of what's happening in Halab, in Aleppo. And many of us also ask in the same question, what can I do? Definitely, we need to raise our hand to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to alleviate their suffering. Definitely, we need to be uh, their voice. Definitely, we need to be there for them. But today... I want to remind myself, my brothers and my sisters, of the hadith of Rasulullah sallallahu when he said, مَا مِنِ امْرِئٍ يَخْذُلُ مُسْلِمًا فِي مَوْضِعٍ يُنْتَقَصُ فِيهِ مِنْ عِرْضِهِ أَوْ يُنْتَهَكُ فِيهِ مِنْ حُرْمَتِهِ إِلَّا خَذَلَهُ اللَّهِ فِي مَوْطِنٍ يُحِبُّ فِي يُحِبُّ فِيهِ نُصْرَتَهِ Any Muslim, any believer, any person who let down his brother or his sister, in a time or place where their honor is being violated and their right being abused, if you let them down, Allah will let you down in a time where you need Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Same thing, ما من امرئ ينصر مسلما في موطن ينتقص فيه من عرضه أو ينتهك فيه من حرمته إلا نصره الله في موطن يحب فيه نصره. If you're able to give a hand, to support, to help your brothers and sisters whenever they are in need, whenever their honor is being violated, whenever their right is being abused, Allah will give you nusra, Allah will give you support, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will help you out in a time where you need Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Akhwana, we see the images on the TV. On YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, all over the places around us. Irhamu man fil ardi, irhamu kum fil sama, man fil sama. Let's have mercy on the people of the earth. Hopefully, and pray that Allah subhanahu wa taala will have mercy on us. Inna ma yirhamu Allah min ibadih rahma. Allah subhanahu wa taala will give His rahma to those who are merciful. The Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم reminded us. إني أحرج عليكم حق الضعيفين اليتيم والمرأة. I warn you not to take care of the needs and the rights of the two weak women and orphans. My brothers and sisters, I invite all of you, inshallah, today, now, not tomorrow, not the day after tomorrow, donate something to your brothers and sisters, alleviate their suffering. Alleviate their suffering. Winter around the corner. It is cold. People have no place to stay. People left without food, without cloth, without money, without anything. And after Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, you are the only one for them. Let's do our best, inshallah. I kindly invite you to go to the charity of your choice, inshallah, and donate. But today, I'm inviting you to visit amoodfoundation.com amoodfoundation.com and send your gift $100, $50, $1,000 whatever Allah open your heart for just do it and remember من أدخل السرور على أهل بيت من المسلمين لم يرى الله له جزاء دون الجنة if you are able to bring a happiness a smile to a Muslim household Allah will reward you with nothing but the Jannah Please do not wait any longer. The situation is dire. People are in need. And your dollar will make a difference. Your hundred dollars will take care of a family. Your fifty dollars will take care, of, take care of an orphan or a widow or an injured or somebody who is sick. Please do not delay your gift any longer. Amoodfoundation.com Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.